Kettlebell basics, anytime you lift the kettlebell up, we want to sit down in the hips and you want to get the eyes up to the ceiling. So you don't want to pick it up like this. You want to sit down, the hips low, eyes up, then make your lift, and then we can start whatever exercise that you're going to be going from. I'm going to start with the kettlebell swings. So this movement is not necessarily a squat. What you're going to do is get some momentum going. You're going to push the hips back. The kettlebell is going to go behind you, and you're going to lock the legs, squeeze the butt together, pull the stomach in at the same time. So you're catching that kettlebell or pushing it. If there's a door open behind you, you're pushing the door open with your hips, and then boom, you're locking the hips forward. And again, you're squeezing the glutes. So, you, so your butt should be real tight right here. And your stomach should be in. I always tell people, imagine like somebody's hitting the stomach. You're not going to go here and extend the hips too far. You're going to go here, tighten those abs up, lock the hips out, lock the legs out. That's how you do those kettlebell swings properly. All right, so there's a movement called a, a squat and press that we do a lot of. And basically, you, you get that weight up, eyes up, we lift. We do a mini kettlebell swing, elbows in tight. And that's how we get it in this front rack position. But we can do standing presses, we can do squatting presses, and a whole bunch of other exercises. But to get that up, I tell people to zip their jacket up. So get your elbows in tight, and then turn the wrist. Shouldn't be hitting you hard, and that's a movement that you're gonna have to play around with to, to get the hang of. All right, so kettlebell squat to high pull. Usually we're going to do this in a similar squat fashion, which means the toes are going to be out, knees are kicking out over the toes, which is unusual. It's going to hit your inner thighs a little bit more than normal. So again, eyes up, squat, knees kicking out, elbows finishing up by the ears, hands to your chin on those. Then we have the bent over rows, which is another common movement here. We're going to put the elbow, the forearm down the knee, that way your lower back's not turning a lot. You're going to get the chest up, and you're going to pull it right to the rib cage. And you're going to stick it for a split second. And you make sure you're using the upper back to do that move. Those are your kettlebell basics.